I'm speechless, sorry. <laughs> I worked really hard. I, um, this last couple of weeks, myself and my coach uh, worked through all the facets of, of the game. I, I put a lot of hours into it. But yeah, I think at the end of the day, it was just me, my swing, and the Lord up there that kept me sane to be able to, to play the game today. Um, being the number one mid -am, you know, a lot of people think women's golf in South Africa, you know, they don't really look up to it. But I just feel that um, it takes a whole lot of stress. It takes a lot of dedication to get up there. And once you are up there, the stress just doubles. And I felt it this week. I really wanted to, to make everybody proud. You know, you feel the judgment coming from all kinds of direction. Um, but yeah, I, I stuck with my guns. And I'm, I'm so happy that I could defend the number one spot. Because, you know, everybody looks, yeah, she's number one, but what is she going to do about it? So at the end of the day, I'm very happy. Um, I did everybody proud, my family, my friends, and I'm just, I'm just overwhelmed. So yeah, it all happened. I think 15 years of golf just culminated into victory. So I'm very happy. Stephanie, oh, well done. She was brilliant today. She just hit it. I don't think you can hit it any straighter. She was attacking those pins so much. So I kept with her until the about the 12th hole and then you know the nerves started creeping in and she was st just still hitting it straight at the pin straight at the pin but uh yeah i think the last hole was an attribute to to the nerves and everything hitting it over the green making but i actually thought it was for a half the last putt so i must confess i think if it was if i knew it was for the win i would have probably missed it <laughs> so yeah but well done steph uh, you gave me a good run for my money <laughs> yeah yeah